Paul, you've seen your team give everything there to come away with a point. Could have been more. Yeah, if we're going to be greedy, it should have been more, let's be fair. Um, and this is a tough place to come. You know, you look at their record in, I think it's 18 games, they've won 16, drawn one, lost one. So this was going to be a real test, but I think we've absolutely worked our socks off. I think we've caused some problems. I think they've caused us some problems as well. I'm not going to kid myself, but we've had some fantastic chances. You know, we've had good bits of play and I just think if we'd have taken a little bit more care we probably could have got more than just one point out of it. Um, saying that um, I, I'm satisfied with the performance and now we've got to make sure we take that on to the next game. They are match winning chances aren't they? If you're going to be yeah. critical you've got to take those. Oh, There's no doubt they're match winning chances um, and you're sitting watching and you're thinking just please let's not be regretting that again but um, Thankfully we haven't. I thought we've defended absolutely magnificently tonight um, against a really difficult side to play against. That's, um, that's probably as good a defensive display as we've had this season. To come here and get a clean sheet, I probably should have won it. Um, I'm, I'm pleased with everything that I've seen from them. It was one aggressive defensively in the right way, so the win in the headers, the win in the first and second contacts, so important. Yeah, massively important. Um, I thought we could have had a little bit of help from the referee as well, but unfortunately we didn't. Um, listen, it's, it's a, it, I'm going to say it again, it's a really tough place to come, so I'm delighted to get a point out of it. Um, I know I could be really picky, I know I could, have, I, I could have expected more out of it because of the way we've gone about it and the chances, but I just, I just think there's been some really, really big performances from us tonight. On that negative side of not taking the chances, are the boys worried about that at the moment? Because we are. it is a little bit of a theme at the moment. Well, I think it's a frustration more than a worry. Um, I think when you defend as resolutely as we did tonight, you probably hope that you're going to go and nick a goal and get some out of it. And I've just used the word nick there, but I don't think we would have nicked it. I mean, you know, the chances first half, you know, we, we, we had a great opportunity early on when Amari could have took his touch across the box and he's in on goal. He takes a touch to cross it um, and it doesn't quite happen. And Morgan's had a chance where it's come through three or four pairs of legs and it just came at him late. Deno's chance there. Um, we've had some... Some really good football, even I'll go in, in, in the one where Owen Moxon just has to slide a ball through for Amari in the first half as well. Some really good opportunities. I thought, I thought the shape that we set up with tonight was right um, and, 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 and was effective and it caused them problems. Um, sadly, we've, we've only taken a point out of it. That was a tweak, Paul, to a 5-2-3. Important them front three, they have to do the defensive midfield work as well, and they did. No, oh, they put a right shift in. I mean, that was the reason I took um, Jordan off, Jordan Gibson, because he was absolutely shattered. He was just starting to flag a little bit and not doing the recovery side of it as well. He was still getting into good areas, um, and I was just hoping that Sonny might be able to just come on and give us a little spark, hoping that Jack might just get one chance back in, in this Derbyshire area where he's, where he's comfortable. Just didn't happen for us. Um, but I think there's a lot of positives that we can take out of the way we've played. We spoke before kickoff about the need to start. They didn't just start, they kept it going through the 90 minutes. That's yeah. really encouraging. Yeah, it is. Yeah, I mean, I thought the start was really good. Um, that's credit to them. You know, it's not. It's nothing to do with uh, with me and the staff. That's the players. They they made that decision to start that way. Um, we have to carry it on. We've got a really good home fixture to look forward to now on Saturday and we have to make sure we're right for it. Um, and, and, you know, if, if you can be picking up a point away from home, especially a tough one like this, and get, get your three points at home, then that, we can say that's a good week for us. You said things were OK so far with the season. Does that add to that, this OK, or does that just add another, another level to well, it? Well, it gives us another point to say we're, we're OK still. Um, I, I really think we should have got three tonight. Um, you know, I would have taken a point before the game, but but I would have the way we've gone about it, the chances we've created, we should have got three points out of it tonight. Um, unfortunately, we haven't, so we still have to be thankful that it was a strong performance to get a point out of it. One more on other matters, Devon Edmo. Any news on those two boys? No, I haven't heard anything. Um, I mean, Edmo's still doing his his recovery. Um, Jamie Devitt's had the scan um, last night. He had the scan. I'm still waiting to hear back the results. Um, Fingers crossed it's not too serious, but we're just going to have to wait and see. Oh, thanks for your time.